got an Electrolux 1505 model canister vac. Lots of these around out in the country. Complete with its electric hose made to use with the uh, um, powered beater bar. And this particular hose has a plug right up in here. So we're going to get this end off so we can get in there and get it out easier. The easiest way to do that is to take this screw out. And then, you know, there's a, there's a gap right here. You get your fingers right around there and just kind of squeeze and pull. See how it's pulling out? And you don't have to take it out all the way. It might snap. You just slide this thing right off now. There we go. And then you got to kind of get your fingers out. Okay. Now, if it was still hooked up to the vacuum on the, um, on the other end, these gold, these two rings around here are powered with electricity for the, uh, for the uh, um, power nozzle. And if you turn the vacuum on, those will be live. So you got to watch that while you have this all uh, taken apart. Now you can get it all unplugged, and when you're done, you might think you just can shove it on, but there's some delicate contacts inside of here. So you go through the same process. Get your fingers in there. Ease that baby back out so you got that gap right there. You know, slide back on almost effortlessly. If you have to push and tug, if you feel it catch, then something's not right. Pop that baby back in. Notice how coarse the screw is. It's a very, it's a special, very short screw. Just take the screwdriver and uh, go back a little bit. You know, dropped into its slot. See how it went in so easy? Went right back into its original threads. Okay, it's all back together.